The photograph that so many of us have become so very familiar with, sadly, and here's another one, unfortunately, it was five years ago today that this young man, Botham John, was shot and killed in his own apartment. The case made national headlines. A Dallas PD officer thinking that she was entering her own apartment. She mistook John for being a burglar. Steve Pickett talked to John's family today, who says the city continues, in their opinion, to ignore its part in Botham John's death. His killing in 2018 captured the nation's conscience. Did a Dallas police officer commit murder when she shot accountant Botham John in his own apartment after mistaking it for her own? A jury convicted former officer Amber Geiger on a murder count. The city soon after named a street after Jean. And today, that street was deemed a diversion from fairness. The only reason this street is named after Botham is because of the recognition of who he was and what he stood for the city. She is Alison Jean, Botham's mother, a group supporting her today, passionately criticizing Dallas Mayor Eric Johnson and city council members for declining any civil payment for Jean's wrongful death. Five years later, not one person from the Dallas City Council, from the mayor right down, has seen it fit to put my family in a room to speak to us about what happened to both of them. Mayor Johnson, we're demanding a meeting with this queen. We have to have a situation where this city can take responsibility when their police officers kill someone. Because you have the audacity to name the street, the mayor, name the street after both and John, but yet you have this family five years later sitting in the sun. It makes no sense at all. There is a federal lawsuit right now with the John family regarding all of this. However, they wish to have a civil settlement with the city. The city today told me they have no comment. In Dallas, Steve Pickett. CBS News, Texas.